One of the strengths of Snippet Variation Suite is the simplicity we bring to importing data. Some of the common data types we work with are genotype data, copy number data, phenotypic data, pedigree data, and this can be in a spreadsheet, a text file, or a vendor-specific file platform. To bring data in, click on the Import menu. As you can see, there are many options. Let's start from the bottom up where we have an RNA-seq tabularized quantification data import, mock, VCF files for sequencing, complete genomics variant files, HapMap, pedigree data, vendor-specific platforms, such as Illumina and Affymetrics, a public data repository and other Golden Helix-specific file formats, and other forms of text files. To dive into these in detail briefly, let's first look at what it would look like to bring in an Excel spreadsheet. Click on the third party tool, browse to your file, and notice this drop down menu. By clicking on it, you can see we can look for CSV files, Excel files, SAS files, SPSS files, and a number of others. Let's bring in an Excel file. This is phenotype data, and we'll set a row label. Let's quickly look at four examples of bringing in other types of data. For Affymetrics chip files, go to the Affymetrics submenu and select Chip File. Select your files or a directory of files and click OK. For an Illumina final report file, Go to the Illumina submenu and select Final Report. Note that there is an Illumina DSF import tool. For Illumina's Genome Studio, Golden Helix has created a simple plugin that will allow you to export your data in a Golden Helix friendly format easily. For pedigree data, we would go down to this Family Pedigree submenu and, for example, select Text Pedigree. Tell SVS how sex and affection status are encoded and click OK. Lastly, for your sequencing studies, go to the Import menu and select VCF file. Add your files, all of them at once, and click Scan. SVS will scan the VCF files and give you a list of options for how you'd like to import that data.